Hello and welcome back to uh, my Pikmin 3 Let's Play. We left off where we had just gotten these two fruits back to the ship and we blasted off and we saw the onion collision, which was really cool. The face wrinkler, that we could make at least two bottles of that thing. At least a bottle and a half. It's kinda big. Come on, gotta make another bottle. Oh man, now we're gonna have to add the strawberry to that bottle. I don't, I don't like whenever we had to mix food or mix the drinks because it just wastes more food. Hurry. Oh. Okay. Now that we're done, we can drink our juice and drink it in very, very disgusting sounding gulps. Ugh. Oh, that's terrible. It's just like. Actually, it's nothing like that, but like. Like, so sometimes you'll hear it like going <sighs> Sounds disgusting. It's good to build our juice supply like this. We should be all right for a little while. Day two. Alf is writing another thing in his diary. Heh, <laughs> only nerds have diaries. Just kidding. You can have a diary. I'm not, I'm not trying to Make fun of you if you have a diary. I'm sorry. Okay. Back on board, we ran an analysis on the fruit we retrieved and found it suitable for copiet consumption. It looks like there's plenty more where that came from. Reuniting with Brittany, finding this fruit, it's still early, but things seem to be taking a turn for the better. Alf. I want the SS Drake. Like, I just want a ship of the SS Drake. It's really cool looking. Saving. Looks like a little planet spinning around the saving thing. I love this scene. It's like it just zooms into the ship. We finally discovered edible matter. Yay. After close analysis, my conclusion is that the fruit juice is delicious. Yes. Never tasted anything like that on Kopai. We need to continue our search and there is more to be had. We should have it. Right, let's focus all of our energy on finding more fruit and absolutely nothing else. We still need the cosmic drive key. We can't get home without that. Right. Let's focus all our energy on retrieving the fruit and the key. And absolutely nothing else. The captain. We still need to find the captain as well. Right. So we'll just get the food, the key, and the captain. Is there anything else I'm forgetting? Actually, no. What's the signal coming from over there? I sincerely hope it's the captain. Let's hurry over and get, get there and find out. Good idea. He might be hogging all the fruit for himself. Man, Brittany doesn't like the captain. She actually just thinks he's a hog. Even though she's the hog, she's the one who gets an extra gulp every single time she drinks the juice. She's just like Louie, but just a little bit nicer. <laughs> oh no, I think it's raining today. Actually, no, it's not raining. I thought it was raining for a second. Okay, time to get the Pikmin out. Wait, I pressed the wrong button, sorry. I remember earlier whenever I said ZR, you could hold that and get all the Pikmin out? It's actually ZL. I was wrong. There we go. It worked! Okay, Pikmin, now we're uh, going to populate as much as we possibly can. Uh, we're gonna make as many Pikmin because there's about to be a boss fight. Um, but if you've never seen the game, then it's gonna be a surprise because it's really scary, actually. It's not really that scary, but it's just big and disgusting. Okay. Okay, uh, any more flowers? There's one. Pellet posies. And that was perfect hit. Like, as soon as he almost hit, it turned gray or turned red from, from gray. So he could use it now. And we could get an extra Pikmin, which is nice. Are there any Pikmin? Oh, no, there's no Pikmin there. We're just gonna have to wait for him to get some. We actually need lots of uh, rock Pikmin, actually, because this fight needs rock Pikmin a lot. Are there any more pellet posies down this way? Nope. What about down this way? Um. Uh, I'm gonna get this data file. I know what it says, but. When the going gets tough, retreat to a hiding place and wait for an opportunity. I'm only getting these, so if you've never played the game, you know what's going on, so. Oop. Boop. Dude, get the pellet. Okay, 
that one Pikmin's just just standing there like he's not supposed to be doing anything, but you're definitely supposed to be doing something. I wonder if in uh, Pikmin 4 they're gonna make um, uh, electric blowhogs. I mean, they, they have the fiery blowhogs and the um, watery blowhogs, but they don't have any electric blowhogs, which would be kind of cool. Also, the electric fences in this game don't immediately just kill your Pikmin. They just, they just kind of stun them, which is a little bit better because you don't just lose Pikmin all of a sudden whenever you throw a Pikmin that's not a yellow Pikmin at an electric gate. All right, I think we got enough Pikmin now, so let's go. The radar is picking up something. Oh my gosh. Oh, I know exactly what it is. Yay, there's a signal coming from here. It must be the captain. Yeah, um, right. It's not the captain. Okay, um, let's go there right away. Okay, the data file says, on the Copad's radar, a line uh, that, I don't even know what, what that is, but I know that what it means. Okay, with your, align the thing right there with your destination and touch go here to start moving. I guess that's called a cursor, maybe. There's even a data file about this. Now that I think about it, there was indeed a go here function built into the radar. How do you, how do you, like, use the radar to force yourself to move somewhere? That's, ugh. <laughs> we should try it out soon. It seems like it'd be helpful if we decided to split into multiple squats. Go here. Ah, fiery blow hog. No, we need to get it. We can't deal with the fiery blow hog. Okay, that's good. That's just a red one. I'll get it anyway. I was hoping it would turn gray so I could get more rock pigment because this boss fight really needs rock pigment because you need it to kind of survive. Pellets retrieved by Pikmin of the same color produce more sprouts. I know that. But if you have never played the game, then you learned something today. Oh, sorry, I just burped in my mouth. I really hope you didn't hear it. You know what? I'm gonna kill you. Me, I'm gonna kill you, me. You with me, me. You going to kill me. Oh no, oh no, the Pikmin's drowning. No. Oh no, water is lethal to Pikmin. I need to blow the whistle and blah, 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 there are materials for constructing a bridge on the opposite shore. If I, we work together, Bri with, if I work together with Brittany, I think we can get that bridge built. Okay. Now let me get my Pikmin, because I need them for a second. One, two, three, four, five. Now I get to pluck them Pikmins. They're called Pikmin. It's not Pikmins, but... It's like men. Men's not men's. Like everyone I know call calls Pikmin Pikmins. If they don't know what the game is, then they call it Pikmins. Like like they're like, I need twenty Pikmins and I'm like, No, it's Pikmin. Also they spell it wrong. They spell it like P I C K M E N. But it's P I K M I N. I don't know, it's kinda weird because I mean I, I can understand why they would spell it that way, because it's men at the end. Um and it's has the word pick. But, I mean, it's kind of weird that Nintendo chose to name it that way. So, um... I think that I'm going to uh, throw Brittany across there! Okay. Red cookies. Throw them across. What even is that thing? Is like, there's a fence there, but it's a tiny, tiny fence. I mean, why would humans want to build that tiny little fence right there. What's that gonna help them with? Oh yeah, take my rock pigment too, Brittany. We, we need that too. Okay. Um, so let's break this thing. And we don't want you guys to carry that. We want the red pigment to carry that because we need the rock pigment again. So, I'm just gonna throw all you guys there. Um... 
One, two, three. Here we go. Actually, no, we don't need the rock human again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine. Darn it, I miscounted! That's okay, that would have gotten it anyway. I mean. Oh gosh, no, I, I didn't mean to call that back. How come pieces just all of a sudden appear back where they were were originally if you call the Pikmin that's holding it? In, in Pikmin 4, I really hope that they make it where like they just drop it on the ground right there if you call them. That'd be a little bit more realistic. Oh, no, Alf, I didn't I didn't tell you to do that. Hold on. Alf, no, you just you're gonna drown yourself down there. Hold on. Let me just switch over to Alf and get him the heck out of there. And I'll get him to come across. All right. Actually, I think I'm gonna end it right here because, well, this video's getting a little bit long. I was hoping we could fight the boss today, but I guess that's kind of a good thing that we're ending it now. So we can um, have can all of the next video to fight the boss, I guess. So uh, I will see you guys in the next video. And um, like, comment, subscribe, and uh, be sure to stay tuned for the next video. Bye.